I'm George Coucher, Chief Executive of the Derbyshire and Nottinghamshire Chamber of Commerce. Uh, and today uh, I'm talking about the Chancellor's Autumn Statement and how important that is for uh, businesses here locally in our area, but also in, in the whole of the UK. Um, we were very pleased uh, to see that the government still stresses the need uh, to bear down on the deficit, uh, obviously to protect our interest rates and particularly our AAA rating nationally. And that is extremely important for business to maintain um, stability uh, so that there can be a degree of confidence going forward. There certainly were some very good uh, elements in this statement which we very much support. Uh, certainly the uh, 1p off corporation tax, uh, the additional capital allowances for small business was extremely good news and very, very, um, very, very welcome. We also are very pleased to see that there is going to be further investment in infrastructure, particularly in housing, uh, roads. Our issue there is how quickly can we deliver these things that's one of the criticisms we have about the announcement in relation to the Business Bank. We're fully supportive of that, but we still have no details about what that bank is going to be and when it's going to be delivered. Um, there were other things in the statement which we welcome. Um, a further £70 million support for companies in terms of international trade. The disappointment was uh, that the autumn statement made no mention of air passenger duty. Um, we had hoped that there would be a, a freezing of this, uh, and as a result of that, uh, we will see fares rise by 2.5%, and that will be particularly hurtful for, uh, for regional airports, of which we have clearly at East Midlands and in Robin Hood Airport, two very important regional airports. Overall, we felt that the autumn statement was a, uh, a positive announcement um, and clearly there were some very good things in it, including the abolition of the 3p rise in, uh, in petrol and diesel rates, uh, which many businesses will very much welcome. But our criticism is much of it is for the medium and long term. And what we do need to see now to give it yet more confidence within the business community is real evidence uh, that the government is really working very hard uh, to get uh, businesses uh, to um, improve their performance, um, seek new markets and create additional employment.